back in Yurio today, and I have all this stuff on the floor. <laughs> I should be doing my work. So, Yurio here, and I just got my Russia jacket, and I thought, oh, okay, Yurio is done now, but actually, remember those cat ears that <laughs> he has in that one episode that someone threw at him? Well, I'm making them because since I make stuff, I thought I could just do that. And why not film it? I'm gonna film me making his cat ears. So what I've done is I've made a pattern, I have my headband, and I've cut out one piece of fabric. And then I thought, film this! <laughs> okay. I should be doing my convention prep work, but, you know, sometimes things are important. Okay, we have ears prepped. Now it's time to go sew them. Come with me to my sewing machine. Huh. Oh, I've never used my foot pedal with shoes on before. Okay, I'm also not trying to sew it in this wig. It's so hard to see out of Yurio's wig. Who would have thought Yurio knows how to sew? Also, I would be doing this in a Russian accent if I knew how. <laughs> My Russian accent is terrible. <laughs> if you want to hear me try and say something in a Russian accent, put it in the comments below and I'll make a video about it. Because <laughs> literally, I'm really, really awful. Despite having Russian blood in me, I can't do it. <laughs> One ear is sewn and ready to be flipped. <laughs> And that makes two. <laughs> okay, let's go back over this way. Cause now it's time to hand sew. Also, I need foam. Don't mind my room right now. It's a mess because I'm in the middle of convention prep. Okay. Okay. 
And the reason I'm doing this in my cosplay right now is because when I'm done, I want to take pictures. I was taking pictures before doing this, and I was just like, wait, I should make ears. And it's like a maybe 30 minutes maximum craft. I've only been filming for 15 right now, so... And when we're done, I'll show you a bonus little thing that I have. Um, <laughs> I got him yesterday, and he's my pride and joy, and I'll show you at the end of the video. You could make this a less timed craft if you didn't sew this onto the headband like I am, but I want it to last longer so I'm sewing it instead of gluing it. Also, thanks neighbor for mowing your lawn while I'm trying to film a video. a nice little video. It'll be fine, they say. There won't be lawnmowers, they say. <laughs> All right, now our headband is done super cute. It does twist around on there, which I'm hoping doesn't affect the ears, because I'm going to try and sew them down nicely. Anyway, let's clean up the seams on One little ear. <laughs> I think that's the perfect shape. I think that's pretty close to the shape that he has in the show. Hey, right. two little cat ears. <laughs> now I need to position them on here. Okay. It's important to t check your test fit before you sew this down. Yeah, 
I can see these need to go out a little bit more to the sides. Pretty cute. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they're not perfect, but I think that's pretty good. Time to sew them down. I know how to make really nice fleece ears because I used to be in a children's play and um, I made eight sets of squirrel ears and tails for the kids so yeah I used to actually design costumes on an actual children's theater type of thing I'm gonna see if I can try and find a photo of all of my squirrels together because I was the squirrel trainer in my fursuit but no promises on finding that photo because it was mm, god maybe six years ago <laughs> I also made a bunch of chipmunk ears and tails for a dance production once, on commission. That was fun. That was like four years ago. Maybe. And we done with cute little year you ears. I'm gonna put them on and show y'all. There we go. Super cute little ears for Yurio for his fan club. <laughs> now I'm gonna go take some pictures because I find them super adorable. Anyway. So. Anything else you want to see me do in cosplay, uh, leave it in the description below. Because since I just changed my channel over to this, um, I have a few ideas, but mainly they're like big, huge projects for the future. But just like little stuff you would like to see me do, answer questions to in cosplay, uh, get to know my cosplaying self more, leave it in the description below. I will see you in the next one. Okay, so it's later and I forgot that I said I was going to show you what I had got yesterday. I got this yesterday. So I don't particularly like his hair over here and I hadn't been buying this plushie for a while except I had to buy this one off of Mercari. It's signed by Victor's voice actor. <laughs> and it was only $20.
and I don't know why it was that cheap, but I love Victor. Victor is my favorite. Um, all three boys are my favorite, but I love Victor so much. And so I had to get the signed copy. This one's not to be like played with or anything. He's just going to sit on a shelf.